Hey, Futurecasters, I'm Dopper 10 Meteorologist Ross Caruso. It's December, so let's talk about the different types of winter precipitation. First off, let's talk about rain, because just like during the summer, spring months, and even in winter, we do see rain from time to time. And we actually do start out with really cold air below freezing in the upper parts of the atmosphere, but we encounter a very warm layer from the upper parts of the atmosphere to the surface, and then that melts and turns into rain. But when we talk about rain, whenever it's really cold out after a couple days in the winter months where temperatures are well below freezing, we get a warm front that comes through. That system then brings rain. And similar to what we would see again in any other month with just plain rain, the grounds are so cold that that rain freezes on contact with the surface, and that's what we call freezing rain. Another situation we call sleet. Sleet is similar to that of snow, but it's actually snow encountering a very warm, shallow layer, which actually melts the snow, but then it falls into another layer of cold air. It refreezes, and that's how we get sleet. And then when we don't have any warm air that's present that isn't above freezing, well, we just see plain snow. There's another interesting type of precipitation that we see, and that's called grapple. Similar to the sleet, it's going to be encountering air that's just slightly cooler, not necessarily warm, because we're still talking about super cooled water droplets with temperatures below freezing. So we have the snow that's falling between that area. And under the right circumstances, what we could have is water droplets that are below freezing. Well, what happens is the droplets freeze when they encounter the snowflakes as they're falling. They collect onto them, and the end result are these white pellets, kind of similar to that of sleet, but very different in the texture. Not only that, it's appearance in looking like tiny snowballs. So next time you go out and you see that it's snowing or raining, it might even be sleet. Let us know what you think, and stay tuned for more Doppler 10 Futurecasters.